Hey. How you doing? Don't talk to my girl. Just stay away from her. Excuse me, son. I heard you told her she was gonna die. That she was gonna end up like Duck. Why'd you go and do that? Because she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. And y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? Do what's best for Clementine. Oh well, then you do have it all figured out. Never mind. Look, Chuck doesn't like that. <laughs> hash it out. Find a map for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you, it won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. I guess he has a good point. Where are you headed? Uh... That way? I mean when we get to Savannah. I got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past... Fourteen years now. I'm sorry to hear that. No one to blame. You're homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. You got any? No. Darn. He's safe up here. You betcha. Little sketchy. It's full of maps and documents. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kitty? Can you just leave me alone? Man. Hey. Hey. It'll be good to get to the water. Still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Yeah. It's the best plan. I don't know about that. I was lucky enough to get it working once. Yeah, let's not fiddle around with that. Is there anything else in here? Anything? Anything? Let's see if he has anything else to say. Hey. Yeah. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. Give me a map. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure... Cat would be uh, okay with you, so forget it. Okay. Man, yeah, guys had it rough. Hey, 
they been? Hey. Aren't many of us left? Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. And so many people have died. We're all homeless. In this episode? Oh, There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah. Guess not. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. See you. Yeah. Sucks. The door to the boxcar. The alcohol. Bottle of whiskey. It's probably empty. Oh. It's a fifth of whiskey. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, I'm gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? For the head. No, these are just bottles, but you have to aim for the head. I know, only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body, anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. Might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Bit to the right. Steady now. Almost got it. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Now it echoes so loudly inside the train. Be like death. Oh, it looked like it was just below. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Okay, a little higher. Huh. Aim more to the right. Close. Now keep it steady. There you go. Nice. Yeah, you did. Good job. I just pretended they were walker heads. Good. Just like you should. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. -uh. I 
I swear if Clementine dies in the show, I will write so much hate mail to the makers. I hope we're not on this train much longer. It's like, yeah, looking at the corner of the train. If everybody died but Clementine lived, I would be okay with that. He's lived here a while. She's so cute. There's some scissors in Chuck's bag. They look clean enough. Oh, this is gonna be an interesting haircut. Hey, Clint. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Nope. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. <laughs> what? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. <laughs> Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. It's not even that long. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Cut hair. And if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. <laughs> that was a death stare. <laughs> do you know how to do this? <laughs> nope, no idea. Nope, no idea. <laughs> uh, not much of a stylist, you know. I'm going to look like a boy. <laughs> but think how much safer you'll be. I'd rather be dead. Shush now. <laughs> I thought they were cutting her hair originally. So you did kill someone before. Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. Uh, I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. You're right. Before all of this, I was sent to jail, you know? Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with something. Here. I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. You look dumb. <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Let's see. I'm sorry about your hair. I think it looks cute, though. My mom isn't going to like it. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. What a crappy day. The crappiest. If three months ago, I'd known what you'd be seeing. I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I probably would have run out of food. You're damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. I need to look around for a few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe there. God, me too. Okay. CPs, anything different to hey, say? Ben. Hey. See you. <laughs> what was that? That was so dumb. This is always kind of glitchy right there. Let's see if he's ready to talk. He looks super, super pale. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land. 
Once we get to Savannah? Man, we already talked about that. You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. You still want to get a vote? It's still the best plan. Care. Yeah. It's the best plan. I don't know. How would they get gas for a boat? Like, I'm sure gas would be really, really hard to come by, even if they found a boat. Oh, wait. Oops. Didn't, didn't mean to do that. Found this in your Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Make him talk. Want a nip? Sure. Ooh. Not known for its finish. A little kid. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. I feel like they're gonna hit something. Well, the girl can shoot. It doesn't have to be pretty. Probably will be before too long. Anything else? You get that hair sorted? Yeah, I don't think she cares for it. She will. Hey. Yo. <laughs> okay. to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. <laughs> Get wasted. Yeah. That's what he's gonna do. Oh, that's what he wants to do. Yes! Now I can get that map. Yeah, that was so dumb. In real life, <laughs> I would just reach over and grab it. Let's see. Is there anything else I can do here? Anything, anything. I can't get on this chair. I guess I'll go show Clem the max. Hey, Ben. Hey. See you. <laughs> yeah. I'm always hoping that he has something else to say, but apparently not. It was me. Huh? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? Oh, man. <coughs> it's all my fault. I kind of thought we... I could kill Expected you. that. I... I... Nobody can see us. I could toss you over right now and be done with it. No! I... Please, please! Why shouldn't I? They said they had my friend! I didn't know what to do! Please, please! I had to tell someone. I bet you did. Oh boy. That was intense. Anything else? No, just a head nod. Oh dear. 